Hello everyone, welcome to Success Education. Today we'll be doing the workbook solution for English for Standard 6, Chapter Number 4, that is Trash to Treasure. Before that, if you have not subscribed my channel till now, please do subscribe it for more videos. So we'll be starting with the question answers. First one: What arrangement did the Maharaja of Travancore do for many important people in his palace? The Maharaja of Travancore ordered a huge dinner in his palace for many important people. Second, why did the Maharaja visit the kitchen? The Maharaja visited the kitchen to see what dishes were being prepared for his guest. Third, what did the king notice in the kitchen? In the kitchen, the king noticed a basket full of many small pieces of vegetables that no one was using. Now, second paragraph question answers. First one, what would the cook do with the vegetable scraps? The cook would throw away the vegetable scraps. Second, what did the Maharaja suggest the cook to do with the scraps? The Maharaja suggested the cook to find a way to use the scraps. Third, why was the cook worried? The cook was worried because he could not think what to do with the vegetable scraps. Now we'll see question number two, uh, two that is uh, MCQs. First one, the Maharaja entered the kitchen to see, it is option number D, what dishes uh, were being prepared for the guest. Second, the king was happy to see, it's option number D, all the three. Third, the king noticed a basket full of, it is option number C, trash of vegetables. Fourth, the cook was greatly confused because he was ignorant about it's option number A, the use of vegetable scraps. Fifth, one of the following was not there in the leftover of vegetables. It is option number A, tomato. Sixth, for whom was a huge dinner ordered in the Maharaja of Travancore's palace? It is option number C, for many important people. Now we will see question number three, that is write the following sentences using antonyms of the underlined words in the sentences. First one, the Maharaja ordered a huge dinner in his palace for many important people. Second, the feast was almost ready. Third, the king noticed a basket full of many small pieces of vegetables. Fourth, the vegetable scraps are waste, sir, we will throw away. We will throw them away. Fifth, the cook only had small amounts of everything except for one thing. Now, question number four, match A with B. First one, Maharaja. It is option number D, Travancore. Second one, guest. It is option number F, important people. Third one, basket. It's option number C, leftovers. Fourth one, head cook. It is option number G, confused person. Fifth one, scrap. It is option number B, yam. Sixth one tree, it is option number E, coconuts. Now we'll see question number five, that is true or false. In that, first, second and third is false. Fourth one is true. Fifth one is false and sixth and seventh are true. Now we will see activity five question answers. First one, what did the cook do with the uh, scrap vegetable bits? The cook washed them, cleaned them, cut them into long strips and put them all into a huge pot and placed it on the fire to cook. Second, what did the cook do with the fresh coconut? The cook ground the fresh coconut, added green chilies, garlic and some salt to it. Third, what was done by the cook after the vegetables were all cooked? When vegetables were all cooked, he stirred in the coconut and plenty of curd, poured on some coconut oil and sprinkled it all with curry leaves and the new dish was ready. Now second paragraph question answers. First one, did the king like the new dish? How can you say so? Yes, the king liked the new dish. He liked it so much that he gave the cook a beautiful gold bracelet as a reward. Second, what was everyone eager to know? Everyone was eager to know the name of the new dish. Even the cook did not know what he could call the mixture of new things. Third, 
how does avial hold importance in kerala now avial is one of the dishes in traditional feast of kerala now question number 2 that is mcqs first one the cook dash the vegetable bits before he put them all into a huge pot to cook it is option number d all the three second the cook added dash to the vegetable bits in the huge pot while cooking it is option number d all the three third the cook sprinkled the vegetable bits in the pot with it is option number c curry leaves fourth the cook got dash as a reward for his new dish from the king it is option number c a gold bracelet fifth the cook had an idea from it is option number c the coconut tree sixth the cook put bits of vegetables it's option number b in a huge pot to cook now question number 3 true or false and that first second and third are true and fourth and fifth are false now we will see grammar part first one is fill in the blanks with the appropriate forms of verbs with the help of these given in the brackets in the first answer is called and was watching second one is have worked third one is loves and goes fourth one is writes is writing and wrote fifth one is got and had been waiting sixth one is was trying slipped and fell seventh one is wake eat leave go uh, got skipped left and forgot eighth one is is reading is making were doing was cooking was reading will do will prepare and will read ninth one is will have completed found will not have accomplished will still be re, uh, studying and will work right now we'll see question number 2 answer the questions keeping in mind the appropriate tenses first answer is jane second one is mary third one is john fourth one is mary and fifth one is bob now second is again adjectives that is degrees of comparison for that first one is fill in the blanks first one bulgaria is an old european state found in 681 second sofia is the largest city in bulgaria third of the two spa hotels the bankia spa palace is most friendly is the most friendly fourth the boyana church is an old church in mount vitosha near sofia fifth the lom river is shallower than the iskar river sixth the cobbled streets in old town in veliko tornavo are narrower than the streets in old town in plovdiv seventh one bulgariana is the largest rendel uh, a baker's book translated into bulgarian eight this year we are ta uh, taking an extended vacation in senemorets at the seaside ninth turkish coffee is more popular in bulgaria than in turkey tenth english is easier than german eleventh this is the most tender meat i have ever eaten twelfth my nephew works in an office building which is more modern than ours 13th violeta is 60 and leda is 88 violeta is younger than leda 14th vera is smarter than mila 15th of the three coffee grinders i like the armenian best i find it most elegant Now question number 2 rewrite the sentences using appropriate forms of the adjectives given in the brackets first one the town is just as large as my native one second the road was longer than we had expected third the girl is very intelligent fourth as soon as they understood that the second book was more boring than the first one they changed their minds Fifth, 
the shop is farther than the school. Six, Ventspils is the farthest town in Latvia I have been to. Seventh, Tim is more intelligent than Pat. Eight, the heat is less harmful than the cold. Ninth, this song is the most beautiful one in the world. Tenth, they are as stubborn as donkeys. Eleventh, the weather today is worse than the weather yesterday. Twelfth, the story was the most exciting one I have ever heard. Thirteenth, they were less tired than we. Fourteenth, George bought a newer car than he could ever imagine. Fifteenth, the mark is better than I expected. Now we will see the writing part. First is information transfer. With the help of the information given below in the table, write two short paragraphs of about 50 words each. So we will see the paragraph. I have uh, written both the paragraph all together. You can separate the two paragraphs and complete it. Okay. So the paragraph is air pollution is caused by vehicles. It is harmful for our health. Cars, trucks and buses emits major part of the air pollution. A lot of harmful gases like carbon dioxide, nitrogen oxide etc. are emitted by the vehicles. The leading effect of vehicle pollution is global warming. It results in the emission of greenhouse gases into the atmosphere and pollutes it. Air pollution not only affects the human health but also affects the growth of trees. Trees are affected by air pollution directly or indirectly. Now second question is, uh, we all know that uh, different kinds of waste is a great threat to our environmental environment. What efforts will you put in at your level to lower down waste and give it another directions to save our environment? Write about 10 to 15 sentences with the help of the given points on it. So the sentences are, wastes are basically of three types that is solid waste, liquid waste and gaseous waste. There are many ways in which we can reduce these waste by reusing, composting, online payments etc. can be done to lower down the waste. Making something innovative and attractive out of the material that is of no use is the best way to reduce or even stop wastage. Paper, glass, iron and steel scraps, wood, plastics etc. can be recycled and fresh things can be made out of it. Creating awareness about the harmful effects of the products that are non-renewable and usage of recycled products is very important. It helps the environment too. Now we will see the poetry comprehension. First one, uh, we need to complete the following sentences based on the given poem. First one, the poet prays to the God for all the blessings of the light. Second, the poet is seeking forgiveness for the ills done by him. Third, the poet is seeking forgiveness for the ills done because he wants to uh, sleep with peace. Fourth, the poet wants to sleep tight so that he can serve God when he wake up. Fifth, the word in the poem that means strong is almighty and vigorous. And here we come to the end of chapter number 4 that is trash to treasure. I hope you have understood the complete chapter. If you have any doubts you can write in the comments section. I will surely try to answer all the questions. Thank you for watching my video and do subscribe my channel for more updates. Thank you.